And after years of delays, the first government-funded mosque in the Greek capital, Athens, has opened its doors to worshippers. Athens has not had a formal mosque since Ottomans left the region nearly 200 years ago. Thousands of Muslims from countries including Pakistan, Syria, Afghanistan and Bangladesh live in Athens. But until now, they had been forced to pray in makeshift mosques, in warehouses or basement apartment buildings. The Muslim community had been lobbying the government for decades, and it seems their prayers have finally been answered. It's an historic moment uh, for the Muslim communities living in Athens. We have been waiting this mosque for so long. Uh, uh, since the law, the first law was uh, passed in 2006, it took 14 years because there were so many bureaucratic barriers uh, and some legal issues uh, uh, with the construction of the mosque. The new building in Athens' Vitanikos district will serve around 500,000 Muslims. Its construction had been riddled with controversy, including the change of locations due to protest by some locals. The construction finally began in 2017, and now after its completion, Muslims are breathing a sigh of relief. The mosque for us Muslims is something very important, and I would like to thank Allah. I would like to thank the Republic of Greece, which helped us to complete this project. Athens was the only European Union capital without an official mosque. Though some Muslims are unhappy with the mosque's appearance, as it lacks a dome or a marinette, others say it's a welcome start.